Hello everyone this is Harsha welcome to my channel Crypto English so i guess today's video is a very special video in this video i got multiple requests in my past videos about mobile based crypto mining so in this video i'll talk about a project in which you can just mine these tokens of the project in your mobile device you need not have a big mining rigs or anything just on a smartphone you can mine this cryptocurrency this token is not yet listed in future it will be listed very soon So along with that they are also going to participate in the Polkadot parachain auctions I'll also talk about the Polkadot parachain auctions team behind it and multiple interesting things about the project So everything will be covered in this video watch this video till end so before starting the video if you are here for the first time subscribe to this channel if you like the video click the like button if you have any doubts or clarification leave them in the comment section below This video like target is 300 likes so definitely click the like button right away So let's be in the video guys So first thing today we are going to talk about the project called Nodal. So Nodal is a crowd sourced decentralized IoT network. So in this uh, they are going to build a, uh, a decentralized network for IoT devices. So we all know the IoT devices so there are they has spread everywhere. So like Alexa smart bulb, smart TV, smart cars everywhere. So now this particular Nodal will be connecting uh, through this IoT devices to internet in a decentralized way. so that is how it is so before going to in detail explanation how this architecture of io uh, uh, nodal works i'll show you how to install nodal app and how you can start earning crypto on your mobile device by mining the currency so to do that all you need to do is you just need to install this nodal app on mobile device the app link will be in the description below so once you install the app the this you'll see some information about the app you just click on next and you can click on create account so if you already created the account if you are using it for the second time then you can use the import account option to import the private keys so now just click on create account then uh, you will be seen this thing and then you just click on start and that's all your app is ready so all you need to do is you just need to give permission bluetooth and location permission to this app so that it will connect to the nearby bluetooth device so just click on the permissions and access the location and then you can see your character moving on the map and whenever you are finding any bluetooth device nearby you can see this coin icon popping up so you are mining certain amount of nodal tokens so on the statistics page you can see the all time and you can see that you are securely connected to the nodal network. work and start earning nodal cash so now that is how simple it is you just need to install this app enable location and you need to walk around the town so if you are staying at one location you may not be earning much nodal cash if you are walking in the city then you will be able to make certain good amount of uh, token mining so here you can see in this example i was connected to three devices so i was rewarded with 0.00103 nodal cash so more devices you connect you will be rewarded the more nodal tokens then you can send this tokens to anyone and receive one but right now it is not listed in any centralized exchange or any decentralized exchange soon they are going to launch their token after the token generation event you will be able to sell these tokens and book some profits so here you can see every day you will be uh, whatever tokens you mine will be credited to your wallet so here you can see i got credit of 0.001 nodal here i got 0.003 tokens this was around 30 to 40 minutes of uh, app usage i was able to earn this money so if you are using for a long term then you can earn even more so if you have any old smart device which you are not using and just install that and take it the, take the phone and roam around so now that's all about the nodal app and how to start mining this nodal cash onto your mobile device so but how how is this entire ecosystem working and why you are rewarded with nodal cash just for walking around the town so now i'll explain you with the example with the help of the architecture from their white paper so in nodal nodal network there are four important participants in the architecture first is the iot devices and then second is a network contributors third is a validator and fourth is a subscribers so now in this scenario whoever me you whoever install the mobile app for making the earnings they are the nodal network contributors so which means we are contributing to the network so what we are doing is whenever we are walking whenever we are finding any small iot device nearby that device will be connected to our nodal app and that blue uh, iot device will be set, sending certain information to our mobile app so to explain in better way i'll just take an example so let's assume there is a shipping company so shipping company what it does it will transport goods from one location to other location so let's assume it is sending some goods in a truck and the so shipping company want to track the details in the truck so to that what they do they will be installing small uh, uh, bluetooth iot device in the ship shipment so which will track the motion location then uh, speed vibration and the weather or temperature of the truck which is carrying the goods 
So now what it does is it doesn't that Bluetooth device is a IoT device and doesn't connect to internet directly. It need a Bluetooth node to send the information. So so what happens whenever me, you, or anyone who installed this nodal app walking or nearby the truck, that truck device which is connected to or which is collected the information will send that information through Bluetooth to our nodal app. So now nodal app will uh, uh, collect this information whenever we are connecting to internet that will send the information through internet to the nodal validators. So now nodal validators validate the nodal data which we have received through the network and they will post the data into the blockchain. So now here comes a tricky part. So these are the subscribers. So subscribers are nothing but the shipping company itself. So shipping company will be paying some certain amount of service fees to the nodal and then they will be accessing the data. So now they can track the uh, uh, shipment wherever it is going with the temperature or other device through the help of this nodal network contributors and they are having the access to that information. So to access that they are paying some amount and validator is paying small amount of reward to the nodal network contributors. That's why you're making this nodal currency when you're walking and connect to your new app by Bluetooth or IoT devices. So that is the entire architecture of the nodal cache and how it works and the complete uh, uh, with a simple example. So now let's talk about the other important achievements of the project. So if you see that nodal network is already available live on Substack network. So the, they already have the blockchain, the, the blocks are running already and they have the blockchain and they have more than 320,000 wallets created on chain. So that is already a big achievement for the project and right now they don't have the token also. So most of the projects nowadays they first launch the token then they will start building the project. So this particular project nodal here they already developed the project they already have the working product and they have already have a couple of projects in pipeline and partnerships and till now they haven't launched the token. So now soon they will be launching the token and that is one good thing about the project. So now Let's talk about the team behind this particular project. So if they are promising such a big thing like a crowd source decentralized IoT network, whether they will be able to deliver or not. So that only depends on the team behind the project. So let's see what uh, who are behind this project. So first uh, founder of this particular project is a uh, uh, Michai Benoli. So I was just searching about this particular uh, founder. I, I found his profile on LinkedIn. So I was just checking it and I found one interesting thing about this particular founder. So he was a co-founder of the fire chat. So if you are not aware of the fire chat, just go to Google and search for fire chat with term Hong Kong. So then you will find very interesting things about this fire chat. So you can see this interview, which was conducted in, uh, which was happened in 2014, October. Here you can see uh, Micha Banoli. So he was a CEO of Open, Gra uh, uh, Open Garden, which developed this uh, fire chat application. So what is fire chat? So fire chat was uh, one of the largest mobile based data mesh network built on that 2014 so 2014 is very old date so that time only this particular product has done very historical thing so what it does is in hong kong there was a protest in 2014 where uh, authorities have disabled the internet connection broadbands everything so now people were not able to communicate with each other who are far away so now this fire chat what it does is it doesn't need any wi-fi or internet or data connectivity it can directly send your message to other user with the help of the bluetooth connectivity same technology used in the nodal app also so now how it works is if you have more number of people using fire chat then the communication will go smoother so it will send a message to your nearby peer and based on that if you're sending to someone very far it will connect through the peers you will send your data to the end user so that is how this fire chat, fire chat was and it was one of the biggest uh, mobile based data mesh network which will connect with a p2p without any internet or wi-fi so he was a founder of that so he this particular team is very good in building this such a such a decentless mesh network so, and they can easily do the same with the nodal also and it is already working so now let's see the other team member who is the garrett so garrett is somewhere linked to the india so he was one of the i was just checking his profile so he was uh, also a product design owner of this uh, in ola labs and he has launched this ola play so ola play is the largest connected ride sharing network on there so this is uh, in india we have a, uh, a cab service called ola so ola is having a ola place a small tab which is connected in every cab where you can access your favorite music and uh, uh, movies so that also developed by this second team member who is garrett so they definitely have a strong team which can deliver this project so now finally let's talk about that polkadot parachain auction so nodal is also participating in polkadot parachain auctions so you can see the information on the uh, parachain auction info here you can see on uh, 6th to 11th auction they are also part of the 
parish in auction so if you are interested in uh, this project if you want to uh, get some tokens before listing either you can do farm the tokens using the app or if you want more share then you can contribute to the network by uh, sharing your dot tokens so total pool reward is 850 million nodal tokens and there is a vesting schedule of 30% will be unlocked on listing and remaining 70% block by block so if you want to contribute you have to submit the white listing process join the white listing white listing form link will be in the description below all you need is just need to give your information as a details and you will be receiving an email with the information once you white listed so the if you are interested in the project if you like the project you can support the project by participating in the crowd loan and at the same time you will be rewarded with certain amount of nodal tokens So now that's all guys that is all about today's video about nodal cash nodal app and how to farm and parish in auction so if this video was interesting if you learned something new in this video do subscribe this channel and leave your feedback in the comments section below and don't forget to click the like button so that's all guys thanks for watching jai hind